Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Crew Bites. Today's recipe is Caramel Custard. Caramel Custard, also known as Creek Caramel or Flan, is a custard dessert with a layer of clear caramel sauce. It's a variant of plain custard where sugar syrup cooked to caramel stage is poured into the mold before adding the custard base and is then usually cooked in the oven in a water bath or by steaming. But in this video, we are going to make a simple eggless version of this dessert which can be prepared in less than 30 minutes and the good thing is there's no need to cook it in the oven nor steam it. So let's see how it's being prepared. So at first let's prepare the caramel. So for that you need sugar, one third cup. So now heat a small saucepan and add about one third cup of sugar and keep a very low flame. To this add one tablespoon of water as well. And now let the sugar to melt completely. Then just swirl the pan and cook until the sugar caramelizes and turn golden. It will take about roughly about five minutes. See it's already turning golden. Now just give it a good mix using a spatula. See once it's um, really golden switch off the flame immediately and then remove the pan from heat or else your um, caramel will get burnt and we don't want that bitter taste. Immediately add one tablespoon of hot water and just mix well. Now pour the caramel carefully into the ramkins or bowls you are using and just give it a good swirl so that it's evenly spread out in the bottom of the ramkin or the bowl. Now repeat the same with the remaining three bowls and just keep it aside while we prepare the custard. See it's already hardened. Keep it aside. Now let's move on to the custard. So for the custard you need whole milk which is full fat milk 2 cups, sugar 3 4 cup, cornstarch or corn flour 5 tablespoons, vanilla extract 1 teaspoon, turmeric powder a pinch that's optional it's just to give that yellow color to the custard. So now to a saucepan add 2 cups of full fat milk, also add in sugar 3 4 cup and corn flour or cornstarch 5 tablespoons and now just using a whisk just mix it really well so that there are no lumps in the mixture see now it's mixed really well now transfer the pan to the stove keep a very low flame and to this add a fat pinch of turmeric powder this is optional it's just to give that yellow tinge to the custard because we are not using any eggs in the custard so it's optional you can also use food color if you like yellow food color so that's totally up to you now just cook the mixture by stirring continuously in a very low flame until the mixture thickens do not keep a high flame and keep stirring continuously see it's going to uh, started to thicken now switch off the flame immediately and remove the pan from heat. Now to this add 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract and give it a good mix and allow it to cool for 2-3 to three minutes before you pour it into the ramekins. So just bear in mind that your custard should be of pourable consistency. So the moment it starts to thicken just remove it from the pan and keep it aside. Now pour it into the prepared ramekins see it's uh, it's got a very um, beautiful yellow color because of the turmeric in it just uh, smoothen the top and then um, just um, fill the remaining bowls or ramekins and allow it to rest for five minutes before you transfer um, transfer it to the refrigerator to chill 
see it's looking so beautiful now now just cover it with the foil or just cling wrap it and refrigerate it for two to three hours or until set completely so this is after being in the refrigerator and completely set I'm going to uh, turn it over and see how it's come out so just place a plate on top of it and just turn it upside down carefully there you go a caramel custard see how beautiful isn't it so you can see a tiny crack on the top which is absolutely fine so don't worry about it so I'll just show you another one as well see so the good thing is that it doesn't affect the texture of the custard see how soft and creamy that is and it's very simple to make that's the highlight of this uh, recipe and there's no egg there's no not much of cooking involved you just need to prepare the caramel and just cook the custard which barely takes five minutes see another way to serve this is once after preparing the custard just pour it into the molds and then once set when you turn it over then you can top it with caramel on top of it so either way you can uh, serve it so please give it a try it's really delicious and it's very easy to make that's the main thing about this recipe and you will definitely love it and let me know your feedback so i hope you all enjoyed today's video see you all soon with more good recipes until then goodbye